You've just cashed a pretty hefty check, and you're ready to deposit it. But wait, you're a Chime user. You've heard about mobile deposit, but you're wondering, can I really deposit that much money through my phone? Great question. Today, we're diving deep into the Chime mobile deposit limit. Let's break it down. Building context, now, mobile deposit is a game changer. It's like having a bank branch in your pocket. No more lines, no more waiting around. You can snap a picture of your check and boom, the money is on its way to your account. But there's a catch, or rather, a limit. How much can you actually deposit? The basics, alright, let's start with the basics. Chime, like most banks, has a limit on how much you can deposit through mobile check deposit. Generally, you can deposit up to $2,000 per check. That means if you have a $3,000 check, you'll need to break it up into two deposits. Monthly limits, but it doesn't stop there. Chime also has a monthly limit on total deposits. This is usually around $10,000. So, even if you can deposit $2,000 per check, you can't exceed that $10,000 mark in a month. It's like having a spending limit, but for deposits. Factors affecting your limit. Now, here's where things get a bit interesting. While the general limits are $2,000 per check and $10,000 per month, your actual limits might be different. Chime considers several factors when determining your deposit limit. Things like how long you've been a Chime member, your deposit history, and your overall account activity can influence your limit. So, if you've been a loyal Chime customer with a solid deposit history, you might qualify for a higher limit. It's like earning trust points. The more you use Chime responsibly, the more they trust you. How to check your limit, wondering what your specific limit is. It's easy to find out. Just open your Chime app, head to settings, then account info, and finally, view limits. There, you'll see your exact deposit limits. Exceeding your limit, so, what happens if you try to deposit more than your limit? Well, the deposit will likely be rejected. It's like trying to spend more than you have on your debit card. The transaction just won't go through. Tips for managing your limit. Okay, so you know the limits, but how can you make the most of them? Here are a few tips. First, plan ahead. If you know you're going to deposit a large check, break it up into smaller deposits to avoid hitting your limit. Second, consider using direct deposit for regular income like your paycheck. This frees up your mobile deposit limit for other checks. Exceptions to the rule, there's one more thing to mention. While the general rules apply to most checks, there might be exceptions. For instance, tax refund checks often have higher limits or no limits at all. So, if you're lucky enough to get a big tax refund, you might be able to deposit it all at once. Conclusion, and there you have it. The Chime mobile deposit limit can be a bit complex, but understanding the basics can save you headaches. Remember, it's all about balance. Use mobile deposit wisely, and you'll enjoy the convenience without any surprises. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time.